Hello everyone, in this video we will see how we can encrypt and decrypt the files in Python using symmetric encryption, which means that we will be using the same key to encrypt and decrypt our file. So just to brief, encryption is a process to convert file in such a format that no one can read its true content without decrypting it and the entire process of this encryption and decryption is known as cryptography. So basically to get started with it, we need to import or install the package named cryptography and then from there we can go ahead so i am on my vs code and the very first thing i'm going to do is i need to install cryptography so that i'm doing it using pip install cryptography so in my bottom panel you can see that it is saying requirement already satisfied because in my case i have already installed it so that's the reason we are getting this message but if you are doing it for the first time then it will install it for you next thing is uh, how we can import it so this is the line we can use it to import and then we can generate the key out of furnit so for that we have a method generate key so i will quickly go ahead and print this key for you so this is how the key looks like in the bottom panel you can see okay the next thing is we need to load the content of our csv file because i am taking input a csv file which we are going to encrypt so this is the file which i am having it is having name age then two records are there so this is the file which we are going to encrypt okay so the next thing i would say is we need to load the content of csv file into the memory and for that we need to create an object which will take key because now we need key to perform all this and inside that we need to pass the file name and in which mode you want to open your file so read mode with binary and let's name it as orange underscore file and i will quickly grab my file name okay and then we'll go ahead and write it just give some name original orange file dot read so with this line we have read the content of our csv file and pull it into the memory next thing is we need to work on the encryption part so for that let's create a variable called encrypted and here you can see that I'm calling the encrypt indentation we need to take care okay so here I'm calling the encrypt method on this object f which is of the furnet type okay next thing is we need to write this encrypted content to some file so for that let me comment out this thing here and then we need to write the encrypted content so for that I have already written a code so it is doing nothing much just reading this and writing this particular stream into our file so the new file name would be the sample en.csv so let's quickly run it once okay so you can see that a file is generated and it is having this content so instead of having the original content like this now it is having encrypted content which is not possible to read I mean by looking at that file you cannot identify what is written inside that so let's quickly try out how we can decrypt this file using the same key and extract the content so for decryption also we need to follow the same mechanism we need to associate the key and then we need to open the file and read binary mode so this is the line which is doing this for us and then at the end we need to write this decrypted content into so i will comment this line here and this is my code for that okay so how we have done is first we have load the original file into the memory and then we call the encrypt method so once the encrypted content is generated then we just return it to a new file which is of this name now next thing comes is the decrypting the content so for decrypting decrypting the content we have taken this encrypted file as an input we have read this content in a variable and then we just call the decrypt 
method so doing this will decrypt the file for us so you can see that on the right hand side the decrypted file is generated which is having the same content as our original file so there is no difference between these two files so this is how we can encrypt and decrypt the file using cryptography i hope you enjoyed today's video and thanks for watching